Hello guys, I am going to show you how to professionally unsolder and solder a DC power jack from a motherboard. In our case, I have a notebook motherboard that I uh, took out from a Dell machine. I, I, I chose Dell because the DC power jack of Dell has a lot of pins. So I was thinking if you can remove a Dell DC power jack, you can as well remove jacks from other machines or maybe tablets so this is a good practice if you know um, this particular model you can uh, also do good or do better with with other models okay let's go ahead I have a clamp here if you don't have a clamp just put some metal underneath it because we're going to use a heat gun Okay, I have a hook gun here. To use this tool is one thing, but I'm gonna show you some technique too. So just just stay tuned. We will say that uh, you already uh, saw this technique um, in YouTube, but um, just bear with me. Stay there, I'm gonna show you another technique to make the solder really, really clean. First, I'm, I'm going to remove this, okay? The removal is no secret here. Anyone can remove it, but not all can make a clean solder and desolder of the part Okay, easy, okay? Let it cool down, okay? This is a little bit hot. This part here is a little bit hot. Let it cool down. See that? There are about one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten holes. Pin through holes. The technique I'm going to show you is by using a solder flux, solder paste. You know, this is a. Uh, it's, the name is flux paste, and this is water soluble. Okay, this is the secret ingredient I'm going to show you. You put this on the, each solder holes. Okay. Okay. What you need is a rubber. You put it underneath because you're going to do a little tap here. You don't want to tap it on the table because uh, any any rubber. Yeah, it's a form of a cushion, something like this. This is a rubber too, so any rubber okay okay now using your heat gun again okay just a little tap there Don't worry, you're not gonna damage your motherboard. Believe me, in a manufacturing area, 
the board is subjected to even uh, stronger vibrations. take a look at it see it's so clean some are using solder sucker or desoldering tool to take it out but believe me so you're only gonna waste your time doing it. it 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 needs a skill to do it but uh, just the heat gun We'll do the desoldering really, really nice. Okay, now this one I took it. I took it out earlier, but this is still a good uh, DC jack, so I'm gonna put it back. You prepare the the pins so that the solder will smoothly touch to the uh, to the legs and to the copper sheen. Now, with your soldering iron. Bear with me, okay? Five seconds, okay? One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand. Okay, the more shiny the uh, the finish, the better. You get a uh, isopropyl alcohol. So it's a clean finish. Okay, that's it guys. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe. Bye.